So, I just got back from Oregon last night about midnight and remembered we had our jackpot tournament tonight. Luckily, I had a few things loaded in my truck. Didn't even look at it to see what it was. But I took both my GoPros and had to change the mounts and things from what I use on my boat to take them on the trip with. Well, they didn't make it back with me. So there's my boat. All ready to go. No GoPro. No GoPro mount. So... Sorry you guys don't get to fish me tonight. And I'm about to die because it was 60s in Oregon in the highs, 70s inland, but on the coast it was 60s and we went up mountains is 40s. And now it's 90 freaking 9 degrees out here. So you guys probably won't miss much anyway. But uh, I'll catch you after a while. If you guys are in luck, I found just enough pieces to rig the camera up on the boat. So you get to come with me after all. Alright guys, made the first cast. It's hot. Gary just said he's going to show us how to catch one. We're going to get it on film right here if he does. And if he don't, it's on film too. He ain't going to show us how to cast. Look, he said he was going to show us, and he showed us. Look at that. He got him. <laughs> so, like I was telling Gary, we're in the dog days of summer out here. It's tough. Water temperature's over 90 degrees. Air temp's about 100. No wind, bright sun, no clouds. It doesn't get much tougher than that. Not for me, anyway. I'm gonna go try to find some shade. Did you leave the trophy at home? Should have. God dang, tell you what. So I don't have a good history of fishing this spot. Not this year anyway, it's been terrible. I skunked once. The other time I caught one fish. I think I caught one fish the next time. So in three times here I've caught two fish. But I'm not letting that get me down. We're going for three tonight. All right, we're rigged up. Let's turn around and try it again. Well, one hit on the reel in right at the boat and broke me off right at the boat. Just hit it and instantly broke it off. So I don't know what happened. I had a bad spot on my line or what? Tied a bad knot, burned my line. I don't know, but it just cost me a fish. All right, we're rigged up running again. Well, venture, we got the skunk out of the boat. <laughs> Bluegill sitting on the bank. Feisty fella. So I just broke my I broke my Ned rig off. 
accidentally tied a wacky head back on. Not only once, but twice, because after I got it tied on, I found a bad spot in my line. So I cut the bad spot off and retied it on, and I was trying to put my bait on and realized, oh, that's the wrong hook. It's hot out here, I'm telling you. Gets to your head. God dang, it's a big one. I've been fishing there all night. How big is it? Golly. Look at that. I've been fishing here all night. She just come up behind me and caught a 17. Nice. Yeah, don't forget a selfie. You want me to take a picture? That made me. <laughs> that made me shake. Have. He was swimming to me. Two hours gets two more fish. I've missed three. Two on this shaky head because I didn't get a good hook set. There we go. Come off. I don't know what the hell the deal is. That's the third one I missed. And he was on there for a minute. I mean, this is not my normal shaky head rod, but you think I'd get one out of three in at least. Thirteen and a half loose fish have been beat up. Alright, sorry, I forgot to turn the camera on. Thirteen and a half, we got two now, need that third one. We'll catch you later, guys.